up again, folks. The goddamn Microsoft Sam is back for another episode of Microsoft Sam Plays Portal Stories Mellow. In the last episode, we fell asleep for many years without knowing and met another Gabe Johnson. Don't worry about the heights. Had a few of my scientists make what's called long fall bo- uh, I mean, aperture science in a bit. Pick that yellow device up. Don't worry. I picked up this device. I wonder what it does. Ooh, what an intense light shine that was. I bet this is an old aperture version of a portal gun. There's an open door nearby. Should take you out of the building. You'll need that new test to move around. Don't worry though, we built a building like this. Uh, don't worry about that. It's just, uh, a new drilling test we're doing down below, yeah, <laughs> to get the salt mines deeper, to get more testing spheres in, yeah, yeah, that's it. Just ignore that. Um, okay. Don't mind all this too, we just had, uh, earthquakes, lots of earthquakes, yeah. Yeah, you get lots of those here in Michigan. Earthquakes, you say? These earthquakes uh, even shook up time a bit. Some stuff from the future got here. Yeah, that's how it's here. Uh, don't worry, it's still 1952. Are you it sure it's 1952? It's because I saw the aperture logo change, as if it were the 70s right, or something. So, the earthquakes kind of did some stuff redecorating in here. Destroy the door too. You'll have to find another way out. Things might look different than what you're used to, but uh, while you were spending that little time sleeping, we had some some uh, aperture science nanomachines come in and build all this stuff. Yeah, yeah, that's it. They're quick little guys, faster than any science guy I got. Okay. Now I just want to make sure you know something before you go any further. We have these new inventions called emancipation grids in place to prevent off. If you turn it off, you can easily turn it back on. That switch isn't like the rest of them. The others trip a circuit breaker that causes an entire part of the facility's power grid to blow up. So remember, the one in here is good. All others, bad. Right. I just turned the power back on so I can just get right into opening that giant vault door. I think these switches were designed for two people. Maybe your, uh, new test has help. The new testing track is just through here. Oh, what the fuck was that thing that nearly fell on me? Just to test your, uh, reflexes. You know, after your short sleep.
Bravo Volta, the... Hold on. Fifth testing track, yes. Fifth. You'll need a portal device to get through. Uh, uh, sorry, I, I meant a portable quantum tunneling device. I have. Look, it's in your hands right now. Uh, the scientists did their job. You'll do fine. Alright, this test has been successfully completed. Now let's move on to the next one. Now everything about this test is lead line, according to my 1950s notes here in my 1950s filing cabinet. It says it's harmful to humans. Uh, I mean, not harmful to humans. You'll be okay. Perfectly fine. Nothing to worry about. Oh, and uh, don't worry about the boxes. We got a ton back stocked ready for this kind of thing. Thrown at the wall, destroyed, rinse and repeat. Useless little things, made them in an hour. That is not easy to. That I wonder what else will be up ahead. I mean, great job, astronauts, Olympian, or war hero. You really are a merit to science, or something like that. J just remember the Nuremberg Olympics. Now see, this test uses the new Aperture Science Innovators Propulsion Gel. It allows you to... No, wait, hold on. This record says they didn't make that until the 70s. Aha, I knew it. It's not 1952. Just, uh, You're totally science. not Gabe Johnson. Second, Mel, I don't think you're that stupid that you're going to fall for this anymore. No, blunt now. I'm not stupid. I'm not Cave Johnson. This isn't the 1950s. Everyone you knew and loved is dead. And now you're stuck here in Aperture Science, done with the trash. Like me. After everyone left because of that boat. Which I'm sure you already knew, but, eh, uh, whatever. However, I can get us out of here. If you're willing to let a voice in the sky who just told you he was lying the entire time he was talking to you control nearly every movement you make. Is that okay? I, I, I'll just take your silence as a yes. Oh, right. You can't answer me. Uh, uh, just do what I say and you'll be fine. Okay? All right. That sounds fine. As long as you help me get out of this place, I will not snap at you.
Wow, this test chamber is hard. And, yes, I found the solution. Alright, I finally completed this test chamber. Now I can move on to the next few parts up ahead. Well, I might as well end this episode off right here. We found solutions to a few other test chambers, as well as someone who was impersonating Kate Johnson. This is Microsoft Sam, signing off for now.